All right, so uh, we've got a couple boxes here that just came in. We've been talking about this for about a year and a half, probably, an APU project, looking at a couple different options, uh, trying to make a cheaper and simpler system people can work on themselves, possibly, or, I mean, the main thing is the cost. I mean, most of you all know, you go out and get a tri-pack or a carrier or whatever, I mean, you're in the $10,000 plus, and they're just a constant maintenance nightmare for the most part from what we see a lot of problems so we've been looking to come up with a simpler solution at the five to six thousand dollar installed price point so we're working with a directly with the manufacturer now we're going to go all electric so we've got our first split unit system here we're going to go ahead and take these out of the box see what they look like and then um, like i said we're, we're going to put together a whole package with a couple different options a couple different tiers i mean uh, conventional batteries, AGMs, or even lithium batteries. So uh, a lot of different options and uh, we wanted to be able to offer, I mean, because it sucks being in a truck and being hot and then having idle on it for me, like I never could stand the vibration and sleep with the truck running, with the big engine running. So it's, uh, it's going to be comfortable, but not for ten to $15,000. So. so we're going to go ahead and open these up, see what we got inside, and then uh, there'll be more to follow on this down the road. So this is going to be our inside unit that goes inside the cab or sleeper of the truck. That looks like a condensation line or a drip line. Nice construction. So you've got all your can controls right here, vents. So this would just mount inside the sleeper of the truck. So this is your inside unit. Actually, you got a uh, remote control as well and hardware. So, like I said, that's the inside unit. to hopefully the outside portion of this. And again, this stuff is all 12 volts DC, so no need for an inverter that's 120. I've seen guys install like these house units which aren't really made to go down the road for the most part due to vibrations and, and rough roads and stuff like that. Stuff can break apart. So they're not really, I guess you could say, insulated for that type of environment. So. These are going to be the covers for your hoses and wiring. And we've got all of our hoses here, already pre-made, much like a uh, AC system, you know, off your engine for the most part. It looks, looks pretty familiar type of stuff. Already insulated. You got wiring harness. And hardware again, and this will be the unit that goes on the back side outside of the truck. So uh, looks like pretty simple. Um, again, we're uh, looking at some different options and packages to put this all together. But uh, like I said, we want to be at about the five, six thousand dollar price point installed, depending on which options a uh, customer would like as far as batteries or heater options and different things like that. So um, so stay tuned. Uh, there'll be a lot more to follow. 
So uh, on top of this, we've got batteries coming in soon and uh, we'll be doing a video on those on different options. So if this is something you're interested in, uh, re please reach out to our uh, shop and uh, maybe be one of our first candidates here. So uh, be a lot more information to come, so stay tuned and uh, we'll see you next time.